Hello and welcome to your video. In this video, I'll be installing the quick start package of Asteroid Framework on a cPanel based server. My name is Chayden and I'm with JoomDev. A quick start package uh, it, you know, contains all the icons, all the demo modules content that is on the demo side in this case. So all these forms, all the modules, all the pages, the menus, everything as is. The very first thing we need to do is download a copy of the quick start package, which I have done already, and go to our file manager uh, after logging into cPanel, of course, and decide the directory you wanna upload it into. You can also do it via FTP if you prefer. I will be creating a new folder named Asteroid 2.0. <clears throat> And uploading in this one and here's the quick start I downloaded this is going to take a few moments as you can see we're almost done I actually paused the video while the upload was happening so we didn't take up too much time while this was being uploaded <clears throat> and almost there the second this turns green we're good to go Shouldn't take that long. And we're good. I'm gonna reload this and there we have our file. Again, you can upload and or extract it locally and upload the extracted files using FTP. It's totally up to you on how you want to do it. I prefer is using the file manager since that makes things simpler. And then we'll go to the root and review the install installer tool. And there's our Joomla regular Joomla installation screen. At this point, we're gonna create go back to the cPanel and create a database, which we can do by going using the MySQL database wizard. We call it asteroid underscore ast two o yeah all right we generate a very strong password oh, I'll, uh, I'll be deleting this as soon as I'm done with the video so we'll just use the password real quick here and there you go oops Perfect. That's your database name and username. Let's go back, put our site name here. Let's try 2.0 test 3.8.13. And we put the same description. All right. And the password would be this. Okay. All right. And for the database, we have the following username and we have the following password. Next. Now this step is critical. You must select Asteroid Framework here in order for your installation to look like this. All right. And install. And this step is going to take anywhere between, you know, 30 seconds to a minute or two. Again, depending on your server resources. As you can see, we're halfway through. And you can see we are done. Now the last step is to delete the installation folder, which we can do using this button right here. And we'll just open these in new tabs. And we can see <clears throat> a demo site, which would look exactly like our demo that was on the server. And there's your asteroid quick start installation. We'll quickly log into the back end too. Make sure all is in good shape. And looks like it is. All right, and that's it. That's how you install asteroid 2.0 quick start on cPanel or any web server for that case. All you need is a MySQL database and permission to upload files. And that's it, yeah.
Thank you for watching.